hi guys welcome back to my channel quickly i want to be showing you on a step-by-step -step tutorial on how you can transform your portrait photos into a landscape especially those ai portrait generated images before we dive right in let's quickly check out this uh african folk tale storytelling channels all over youtube if you look at this particular niche on youtube you'll find that it's doing very well on youtube regardless of how much subscribers each youtuber has you will see that they are getting millions of views on their videos and thousands of views on their videos guys take a look at what i'm showing you did you notice anything oh yes what is that all their images or characters are not real human they are ai generated images this content creators uses ai website to generate images for each characters of their storytelling i want to assure you that 98 percent of content creators that deals with this particular niche on youtube they all use this ai website called microsoft bing to generate amazing high quality images oh yes this is not because there are no other website where you can generate images for free but this is because beans give you a very high quality images that look so real like human if you know how to type your prompt very well oh yes if you know how to type your prompt very well microsoft bing will generate amazing high quality images for you compared to other ai websites like ideogram uh, leonardo.ai and many more i can assure you that microsoft bing is highly recommended guys let me show you an example of what i mean now i want to type a particular prompt here in microsoft bing guys i already typed the prompt before now let's see the images that i got as can you see this this is beautiful this is beautiful look at the prompt that i typed oh, did you see how stunning the photo is oh my gosh this is beautiful now check out the next image did you see exactly if you know how to construct your prompt very well trust me microsoft bing is going to give you high quality image now the only disadvantage with microsoft bing is that it doesn't give you that possibility to choose between landscape and portrait guys if you know that it's possible to do that please put it on the comment section from my research and with what i know it is not possible to uh, choose between landscape and portrait unlike leonardo.ai but guys if you know you can do that please you can put it in the comment section now without wasting much of your time join me as i will be showing you on a step-by-step -step tutorial how you can turn your portrait photos from like this now into a landscape let's go to canva and work together okay guys here we are on canva now if you are new to this uh particular website or app you'll be asked to sign in in a few steps guys don't worry you can do that without any stress just type youtube videos just click on create a blank youtube video click on this upload here to have your images imported one after the other you want to use your image to create YouTube video. Maybe you are into this uh, storytelling niche. I assume already that you have already generated each of your images for each of the same and characters of your video. So if you want to use it, you follow this process. But if you're using it for uh, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, I don't see any reasons why you should convert the images into a landscape. Click on upload file to have your images imported down here one after the other just click on this image to have it inserted inside this box or you drag it in whichever way next just try to elongate it a little bit try to drag it to fit in to the top side of the box drag it a little bit uh-huh then leave it this way next click on edit photo click on magic expand then next you click on whole page then click on magic expand and wait a few moment wow can you see this guys this is how you will generate each characters of your story one after the other so that you will have a photo that will properly fit in the youtube format without having to cut out any part of the photo because no matter how you edit it no matter any of the editing app you will use you can get this 
Guys, after this, I'm still going to show you another website that you can do similar thing. But first, let's finish with Canva. Now, the good thing about Canva is that you'll be given possibilities to choose among four images. Come on, guys, check out this. Wow, did you see how stunning the images are? Oh my god, this is beautiful. Did you see? Wow, without having to cut out any part of the image. This is how you generate each of your images without having to cut out any part of the image. I'm very sure if you want to use CapCut, InShot, uh, Keymaster, or whatever editing app to do this job, they can never ever help you to do this. Now, this is the first method. Now, let's go to the second method. Click on Done to save it. Now, this is the second method I want to show you. Click on your, your photo to have it inserted. Drag it a bit up and down. Click on your edit. Click on Magic Grab. This will help you to separate the image from the background. Now, take out the image. Put it aside. Go back and click on the background itself. Then go back and click on Magic Expand. Next, click on whole page. Click on Magic Expand. Guys, if you have watched this video to this very point, I assume you like this video. Don't hesitate to smash the subscribe button if today is your first time of coming across my video. And don't hesitate to put thumbs up already on this video. And God bless you as you do that. Okay, guys, as you can see, it has helped us to expand the background. Don't forget the photo itself is nowhere to be found at this moment, but don't worry, we're gonna bring it back. Okay guys, now click on done. Aha, uh -huh. did you see? Now you can drag your photo left or right or put it any position you want to put it. You can put it here if you want, you can put it here. If you like, you can put it here. Oh my God, guys, what are you waiting for? Come on, go get your Canva account. Canva is so amazing. If you want, you can put it here. Anyhow, anyhow you want to insert it, you can put it here. You can put it here. Guys, these are the two ways you do it using your Canva. Next, I'm going to show you another website that you can also use to do the same job. But before we do that, now we have successfully turned our photo from portrait into a landscape now let's turn it from a landscape into a portrait just come here and click on create a new design type youtube short or instagram reels it will take you to this page here okay same process guys click on upload let's use the same image Click on the image guys you know if you drag it this way like this you will have some part of the image cut off there's no way you can get the complete component of the photo if you if you have to do it like this you have some parts cut off so in order to do it properly what do you need to do click the image like this drag a little bit a little bit make it to fit in both left and right Okay. What next do you need to do? Click on edit as usual. Click on magic expand. Then click on whole page. Again, you click on magic expand and wait a few moments. Hola, guys, can you see our stony images? Oh my god, guys, can you see it? This image is are beautiful canva is so wonderful guys can you see now let's check out let's check them out wow guys did you see the magic the magic really took place the lady wasn't putting on even a long skirt well designed like this can you see now now we have a long skirt well designed beautiful dress oh my god canva is doing wonder guys can you see what i'm seeing guys canva is doing wonders this is really magic. This is magic, guys. What are you still waiting for? Go grab it, grab it. Download your Canva if you're using your phone. Download it. Go sign in if you're using your PC. 
The only problem is that if you're using your phone, you have limitations to some of these features. I'm sorry if you're using your phone. <laughs> okay, guys, what next do you need to do? Just click on the download and you are done. As simple as this. Now, guys, if you don't want to use Canva or probably you don't have the Pro, now I want to take you to another AI website that can help you do similar job. Join me, guys, quickly. Let's rush down there and do our job. Okay, guys, let's assume you don't have the pro plan for Canva. Now, I want to show you an AI website that you can use to also transform your portrait photo into a landscape without paying a dime. This AI website is free of charge and it's called cloudinary.com. Click on it. It will open a page like this. Sign in with your email or with your Google account. If you trust the website, just click on fill, click on this fill here, and then click on this upload image, this very plus sign here, click on it, then click on this browse or drag and drop your image here, or just click on this browse, it will take you directly to your file where you can have your image imported. Okay, guys, here we are. Here is our image. Now, this is our portrait image. What do you need to do? Click on this select new aspect ratio here. Click on it to choose white screen landscape 60.9. It's your YouTube format size. Click on it and then click on fill to have it transform. Let's wait for the transformation. Oh, wow, guys, this is amazing. Can you see it? Wow, here is our landscape photo. Guys, check it out. From portrait to landscape. Can you see this? Wow, this is beautiful. Guys, I really want to advise you, if you don't have Canva Pro, just go to this website. It is free. As you can see, we did not pay a dime. Go to this website and convert your portrait photos into a landscape. Guys, I really hope you like this video. We're wrapping up our video here. We've come to the end of the video for today. We are wrapping it up here. If you know you really like this video, guys, please don't hesitate to smash the subscribe button if it's your first time of watching. And don't hesitate to put that thumbs up there so that YouTube can recommend this video for more people. And this will also encourage me to do more videos like this. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate your time. See you on my next video. God bless you. Bye-bye. Shalom. A heart speed to the city streets. We begin to feel the fire. We rise like